The MZ2Q sensor from SICK is a magnetic cylinder sensor available in both T-slot and C-slot housings. This cylinder has a T-slot, which the sensor easily drops into. The sensor needs to be moved to the middle of the cylinder before securing it. It is easily tightened using either a flathead screwdriver or Allen key. Once tightened, the sensor is extremely secure in the slot. A gentle tug on the cable ensures the sensor is stable and will hold up against shock and vibration. To teach the sensor, move the piston to the first switching point location. Press and hold the teach button until the first LED blinks. Release the button. Move the piston to the second switching point location. Press the teach button one more time. Now, both locations are taught. If you remove part of the cylinder, you have a better view of what's really happening. The magnet on the piston is triggering the outputs in the locations that were just taught. This has the same effect as using two cylinder sensors, except with less time for mounting and wiring. In this example, two MZ2Q sensors are being used. One, to determine the switch points of the gripper to know at what point to squeeze and release the object. The other sensor is determining the distance to travel to pick up the object and where to drop it. The MZ2Q is like two sensors in one. It saves space since it only uses one slot, saves setup time, and saves cost since users only buy a single sensor but get the performance of two. If you would like more information about the MZ2Q sensor, visit us at sickusa.com.